Hey, what's up guys? In this video, I'm gonna give my own personal review of the new school platform and also show you how to set up your own community in school. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Jake from startblogging101.com. Let's get right into it. Some absolutely massive news that just came out less than a week ago is that Alex Hormozy invested his largest investment of his life into the school.com platform. And if you don't already know Alex Hormozy, he is by far one of my favorite business and marketing gurus out there. In fact, he has written the book $100 million offers, which is the first book in his series. And this book teaches you how to make offers so good that people feel stupid saying no. And then his second book, which he released in 2023 with an absolutely massive virtual event was $100 million leads. And this one teaches you how to get strangers to want to buy your stuff. And he has already announced that he has finished his third book. And so this was really awesome. Back in the school community, you can see that Alex Hermosi posted four days ago as of the making of this video. And he said, new to school, who dis? And so this post got pinned to the top and has gotten a ton of engagement. In fact, Alex Hermosi has already reached the top of the 30 day leaderboard simply because of this post. You can see that he already has a score of 679, which is a matter of likes on his posts. And if you click in here, I had commented on here and tagged Alex Hermosi and said, hey, we're waiting for the new book, $100 million school. And another guy joked that it would be called the $100 million communities, which is also a really awesome name. And so who knows, maybe Alex Hermosi will create a book in the future that teaches you how to build a $100 million community on the school platform. So here is a look at the school site. And just in case you didn't already know, it's spelled S K O. O -O -L. So there are a ton of different scenarios that you can use school for, but I would say the number one use case is for an online course. And the best part is that the online course and the community are very, very tightly knit together. And so it's a fantastic option if you want to build a thriving community based around a knowledge product such as a course. And so I personally teach others how to build fast, profitable WordPress websites that generate passive income through affiliate marketing. And although there are a number of WordPress options for different learning management systems out there, there just never seems to be a perfect solution when it comes to building a community around it as well. And so I had been personally looking for a solution to host my course platform and to also have a fantastic community built around it. And so I'm in dozens of different WordPress Facebook groups online and I run a few myself. And so Facebook groups have been pretty nice over the years. There are so many people on Facebook. And so it's a good way to get a number of people into your group and have people asking questions and be able to help out. But one of the biggest problems is that I find it really hard to keep users engaged on Facebook because Facebook has an entire feed. And so whenever somebody logs into Facebook, they tend to get completely lost in their feed and distracted from being in the Facebook group and being engaged. And then another huge issue is that there's no easy way to tie your course content into your Facebook group. And it just ends up being two separate platforms that people have to manage. And so here we are back on the school platform. And here is their features page that highlights all of the best features that they have. And you can see that the very first two here are community and classroom. And so here we are on the actual school community itself. This is the official community from the school platform. And you can see that we're on the community tab here. And so here is the entire community page. And this is where people make posts. And then you can come in here and like these posts or you can add comments. And it's just a really easy way to keep people engaged throughout your group. And then if we scroll back up here and we jump over to the classroom tab, here are all the individual courses that you can have within your community and you can have an unlimited amount of courses within each community. And so you can see that school here has a school 101 course that teaches you just the basics of how to use school. They have a different course here for different subscriptions and how subscriptions work within school. And then you can add as many of these courses as you would like within school. And another really, really nice feature of school is you can see that this course right down here that says to visit the school HQ, it doesn't unlock until you're level seven. And so here is one of the private communities that I am a part of in the school platform. And you can see that I'm on the leaderboards tab here, which is another really nice feature within school. And here is my profile. And you can see that I am currently level six. And what's really cool about school is that you can unlock certain courses and things for your students or members once they reach a certain level. And so for this group, you can see that 52% of members are at level one, 
22% of members are at level two. And then as we go all the way down, you can see that only 1% of members are in level six. And here is a really nice help article from school that talks about points and leveling. So basically you get points by getting likes on your posts or your comments. And so this is a super nice gamification feature that school has that really encourages engagement among students. And whether you unlock something at a higher level or not within your own community, it's still just a really nice feature and it's just a subconscious thing where people want to unlock points and reach the top. So back on the features page here, I just wanna go over a few of the other features that I think are really amazing in school and set it apart from other platforms like this. And so the third one that they have listed here is a calendar. And so there is a really, really nice calendar integration. And this can be used within your community to be able to set live Q and A's, different live meetup events, whatever it might be. And so here is an example of that calendar feature in effect here on one of the private communities that I'm a part of. And so you can see on Mondays and Wednesdays at certain times there are live Q and A's. And then if you click in here, you can see different information about that event. And then there's a really nice button down here that if you click this, you can then really easily add this to any of your calendars with one click. And so I really like this feature in school. And then if we scroll down on the features here, here is that gamification that I was talking about where you unlock different levels as you get different likes on your posts and your comments. And so it just really encourages you to post helpful content in different communities, get people to like your stuff. And school is so much better than other communities that you see out there, such as Facebook groups, because there are so many times that people leave really low value posts inside these communities and they don't get a lot of engagement. And that's just not good overall for communities in general. One really simple but nice feature is they have email broadcasts. So if you are making a post in your community with one click, it can automatically go and send an email to all of your users. And so that's really nice without having to set up a full CRM or anything like that. And any post that is really big news for your members, you can go in and choose that option to email all your members so that you can let them know in one fell swoop. In fact, talking about Facebook groups, there are so many times that I make an important post in my Facebook group and I might link out to my main website. And anytime that you include a link in Facebook groups, they do anything in their power to not have people leave Facebook and so it barely shows it to anybody. And so I might make a really important post and only 10 to 20% of my community might end up seeing it. And so school is just infinitely better when it comes to Facebook groups in this regard, because if you're making a really important post in your community, you can really easily add an attachment for different images. You can add a link to an external website. You can add a video such as a link to a YouTube video. You can add polls, add different actions. And there's just so many things that you can do with school. And school is not gonna hide this post from your members just so that you stay on the school platform. Hands down, one of my favorite features in school is their search. And so this is another massive advantage over Facebook groups is their searchability is so much better in showing you relevant topics and all the areas that that search term pops up. So let me show you an example of this. So one question that I had with school communities and that a number of people ask is a free community versus a paid community. And so if you come into the school community here and I searched free versus paid, you can see that wherever free versus paid shows up, so it showed up in the title here, it showed up in one of the responses here or in comments here. And then another really nice thing is that if this term pops up in the classroom or in the videos, it will also show there. And so you can see in the community, there were 16 results that popped up but also in the classroom, there were 12 results that popped up. So let's click on this. And so here's what I'm talking about. You can see that these are all different videos within the school community. And so you can see that free or versus or paid, whenever these terms show up in these videos, it is highlighting these. And so you can see right here, it says, can you invite free members to a paid group? And if you try to search something like this in a Facebook group, you have no idea what type of results are gonna show up. And so here's an example here in my own Facebook group where I searched for the term affiliate marketing. And the very first result that comes up is relevant to the term. And this is a poll that I ran. And you can see that I posted this back in August of 2023. But there are no terms that are highlighted here. I don't know where it is finding this. You can see that there's a few options to filter over here if you've seen the post or you can also search most recent, but I've never had a good experience in searching for different posts 
on Facebook and I can never find what it is exactly that I need. And so back in school here, I find that the searchability is so much better. I will say that there definitely needs to be some improvements here in the searchability factor, but keep in mind that school is a newer platform and with Alex Hermosi announcing that he has invested in the platform, you are going to see a massive amount of resources and things like that dedicated to the platform to start cranking out features. And I think that this is gonna become a fully fledged, amazing platform for running your courses and communities. But just to show you what I mean on how I think it could be improved is if you come in here and you search for a longer term. So here I've searched for the term, how to make money with school. And I know that there are a number of people that have talked about this, but perhaps they haven't written this exact term like this, but you can see that in the community, there were zero results here. And so just searching for terms in general is a complex problem that is hard to solve because you need to figure out if you should break up each of these words and search for just those words, or if you should search for different terms that are bundled together. So if I go to classroom here, you can see that the terms how and money highlighted in this scenario, but in the second one here, you can see that only the word how was used twice. And so it showed that, but this specific video isn't how to make money with school. And so it's not exactly relevant, but I do still feel that school has much better searchability than other platforms out there. And I do think that it will get even better with time. And then the last feature that I wanna highlight here is the auto affiliate feature. And this thing is absolutely incredible. And so whenever you sign up for your own community in school, you automatically become an affiliate for school. And then if any of your members create a community from your community, you end up automatically getting a 40% commission on their community. And so that just ends up becoming an income stream and school ends up paying for itself within only a few referrals. And so here I am in a brand new community that I just created to show you an example here and say that I am a member in this community and I come up to this tab here that says to switch communities and I click on the option here that says create a community. Here is the school sign up page and it says create your community and it's free for the first 14 days, which is another really nice perk is that if you sign up to create your own community, you get a free 14 day trial where you can try out all the features. And if you don't like it, you can simply cancel with one click. And then you can see that it's $99 a month after that. And here's what I was talking about. You can see it says you were referred by Jake Fole, which is me. And so if any of my students or members in my communities come in and create a community, I'm automatically going to get that referral commission and get paid 40% of that new person's community automatically every single month. And so I think that is an absolutely genius move from the school team. And this is a way that you're going to see exponential growth in the school platform. In fact, in Alex Hormozzi's investment post here, you can see he says to give you an idea, users are joining school communities so fast that host payouts are growing by 62% per month. That is not a typo. That is absolutely insane. And that is before Alex Hormozzi invested in school. And so there is literally no better time to get into school and create your own community because we are going to start seeing absolutely exponential growth with school and all of the communities within. And so since this is a full school review, I do want to talk about a few of the things that I think school could improve on. So I already talked a bit about how I think that the search is really, really fantastic, but I do think it could be even better. And then another thing, since I am creating my very own community in school, with my own course that will teach people how to create fast, profitable WordPress websites that create passive income through affiliate marketing. I have a course here that I'm getting set up. And when you add a module here, so this module says, what domain name should I choose? If I edit this here, there's an option to add a video. So I'm gonna click on this. And then you can see that right now, they only have an option for YouTube, Vimeo, Loom, or Wistia. And so this is one of my complaints. And I do wish that school had their very own native video hosting, but I have already looked this up and I know that this is a very, very important feature for school to have. And they have mentioned that this is going to be coming in early 2024. And so by the time that you watch this video, they might already have native video hosting. But at the time, you can currently only host with third-party platforms such as YouTube, which I don't wanna do because the video privacy is not good on that. 
and then I don't wanna pay for a third-party hosting service such as Vimeo or Loom because I'm already paying for school. And so I think that'd be really, really nice if that was just built into the school platform. And like I said, I know it's coming and so it might already be there by the time that you watch this video. And then a third thing that I think that the school platform could improve on is notifications. And so I will say that I do like the notifications better than Facebook, but I feel that school gives you too many notifications and you can actually see right now that I am a little notification crazy. I have 55 notifications, I have 22 messages. And so the thing with school right now is anytime that a single person likes a post that you made or a comment that you posted, it will give you a notification for each of those likes. And so I think that's a little over the top. I wish that they would group those likes together like Facebook does, for example, if 10 people like your post, I wish that it would say that so-and-so liked your post plus nine others and create that as one single notification rather than 10 individual notifications. And then I also wish that you could filter down your notifications. So for example, maybe you don't wanna see notifications if somebody likes a post and you only wanna see a notification if someone maybe mentions you in a post or they comment on your post because those are more important notifications and simply getting a notification that somebody liked your post might not be something that you want to see and you might not want to be distracted by that. And so all in all, I think that School is an absolutely amazing platform already and it is going to get even better with time, especially after Alex Hermosi's announcement that he has invested in the platform. And I would highly recommend you come to school.com slash community, which is School's official community here and scroll through these posts and see all of the very inspiring and motivational posts out there. There are so many good questions being asked and there are tons and tons of success stories of people that are making $20,000, $50,000, $200,000 a month with different school communities by having a separate free community and then a paid community that they get people into that has more premium content. And so if you do want to get in on the action, there is literally no better time than right now because I promise you that within a few months, this is going to be absolutely exploding with members and new communities coming out. And so I'll have a link in the description below to sign up and that will bring you to a page that looks like this that I showed you earlier where you can create your own community. Like I said, there is a a completely free 14 day trial that gives you everything that you need for those 14 days at no cost. So you can come in here and just try it out. And if you don't like it, simply cancel with one click. And although school is slightly pricier than other platforms that are similar to it, I absolutely think it is worth the money because it is such a well-rounded and polished platform already. It's going to get way, way better with time. And like I mentioned, there is that auto affiliate feature where if you create a community, you automatically become an affiliate for school. And then if any of your members or students sign up for their own communities, you get paid a 40% recurring commission on their community. And so it just ends up becoming an entire income stream and you can make a massive amount of money from school while also hosting your own community. I would highly recommend going to school.com slash discovery. And here you can discover many of the most engaged communities out there. And you can even filter them down so you can see that there is business, there's health and fitness, personal development, arts and crafts, music, and so whatever it is that you're interested in, you can come in here and filter them down and you can go through all of the different communities out there and see whether they're free or whether they're paid or whatever it might be. And so that's my personal review on the school platform. Like I said, I'm currently working on my own course and community and I had been searching all over for the best solution out there. And I'm so glad that I ended up joining my first school community well over a year ago and found this platform before it blew up. And now it's just going to exponentially grow with Alex Hermosi's investment. And so I hope that this school review Review helped you out. If it did, leave me a comment below and let me know what you think of school if you get in there and start your own community. And definitely take advantage of that 14 day free trial. See if you like it. See if all of the features are what you're looking for for a course and community for your group. Hey, if you like this video, it would be awesome if you could give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and ring that bell. And I'll see you guys in the next video.